Hello and welcome to How Not to Play, the channel where I play video games badly. Today we are going to be continuing our platinum playthrough for Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, the sequel to Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, while we're going through this video, if you see anything that I did incorrectly or could have done better or missed along the way, please put it in the comments below. I do want to make this as complete a walkthrough as possible. While you're down there, go ahead and hit that like button. It really helps push these videos out into the algorithm to get more hits and more viewers. Uh, subscribe if you would like to get notifications on future installments. But enough of that, let's go ahead and get into some gameplay. Just gonna float there. Hey, where are the others? We're good. Just taking a quick dip to get the crime off. Do you see a way back up? We'll find one. We'll meet you at the exit. Okay. Hojo's lab was filled with men like this. Mako poisoned. Every last one of them. Poor bastards. What do you think their deal is? Where they going? They're following Sephiroth. Or so Cloud seems to think. He did say that. Let's hope the boy can keep it together. All right, well, we are now Sans Cloud, so uh, let's see, exploring as Barret, press uh, square to unleash a hail of bullets to destroy crates, obstructions, mithril crystals containing items and trans materials. Alrighty. Uh, we probably also want to grab that assess materia. Alright. Oh, looky here. We've got... Oh, that little reticule just shows me that there's something I can shoot, so... We just we go ahead and start shooting it. And get that off the screen. Uh, here we have a weapons cache. And we get Renegade Collar. That's gonna be a red weapon. So I'll upgrade his mithril collar to the renegade's collar. Slash it at foes. Uh, crescent claw proficiency bonus to finish them off. Upgrade his attack a little bit. We can check our uh, vending machine, grab a couple more high potions on the cheap. Wait, add something else. Oh, a bone bracelet. All right, yeah, let's grab one of them on the cheap too. And we can actually transmute it into an enhanced bone bracelet since we've uh, been waiting to do that. Give it that little bit more upgrade. And now that we've collected some mithril ore, uh, we can actually uh, craft some revival earrings as well. So sure, might as well. We're not quite at level seven, 
but we are pretty dang close. And we've got another folio automat thing, but we can't use that until we level up. Uh, we can rest to regain HP MP. Uh, not that I think we need it. But whatever. Speaking of shooting stuff. We've got a plan here that seems to take reduced damage from uh, physical skills. Let's, Let's give them a quick assess. They are weak to fire. And exploiting elemental weaknesses drops them. So, yep, let's. What do we got here? Wildfire should do that. If we can't level up the pressure ball, maybe. Alright. That was fun. Change a chunk of iron ore. Bet shooting those things will get you some materials. Alright. How we getting out of here? That would be an option. Oh, we gotta climb up that, uh, whatever that thing is. So we could swim across here and just go straight to the exit. But what fun would that be? Let's do some exploring over here first. So our exploration over here wasn't necessarily fruitful, but we were able to come up here and up in this little peak we did find Pick it up, bear it, bear it, pick it up, pick, pick it, get it, get it, there we go. MP up. Alright, that probably wasn't worth it, but <sighs> did get some mithril lore for shooting those things. And once you're done exploring, just make your way over here to, I'm not entirely sure where, okay, and we can start climbing up this rock thing. Anyway, we made it up here. I think Barrett just likes blowing things up. Oh, probably up this way. Yep, here we go. Keep climbing. Somewhere. 
have to start battle, then I can assess with the middle button. Uh, weakness to wind? I don't know that I have any wind attacks. No, not here. You got this. Oh shit, something happened. Wind current, there we go. That was really easy. Okay, we've got another chest over here. Oh, and some crawlers. In our chest, we get five beast bones. I'm sure, we can use those to craft something. Okay, so we need to get up there. We have a switch here and a chest up there. So I'm guessing we can pull this cart whichever direction the switch goes. So let's go for the chest first. Very nice. We'll pull this past the switch. Make the switch. Hold triangle to make the switch. Now we can get out of here. Let's go ahead and get rid of this guy. He is weak to fire. from, I believe.
And the way out is gonna be through this rock. We can shoot down that counterweight. It'll raise that bridge up to where they can get across. Uh, let's see. How do I get it though? I see, just shoot ladders and they come down. Alright. Good. Cool. Alright. Yeah. Makes perfect sense. So, up here on this ledge, we can get a thousand gil. There must be some way we can dislodge that container. Uh, looks like I'll need to go to the other side. Yep, I went up the wrong one. Alright, so how about this one? What's up here? Looks like we've got another uh, vending machine. And rest area. They're really laying those on thick, aren't they? Let's see if this pops these doors open. Yeah. There's some interior over there, though. How do I get to that? Might just have to put a pin in it. Alright, so we've got a treasure chest over here. With some high ether, we've got a boulder in the way, but we know how to get rid of that, don't we? We'll just keep pushing through. Another switch, yup. So we'll get it. Uh, is that good enough? Let's go a little bit farther. There we go. Now we're past the junction. Before we hit the switch though, let's see what's on the other side.
just some mats. Alright. Flip the switch then. Red, you might want to move. And then I assume we just kind of push this off the cliff. they can flip that other side that we were wanting to get that materia from I don't think we can open it from here see a button or a lever one sec good Thanks job Aerith yep two grand that's fair <laughs> Lightning materia, all right. Uh oh. Oh shit, that's not a rock. Oh shit, they do look it up. It, it, it is a one like. Then it's time to rock Cranky Boy here back to sleep. Ah, looks okay, like it is a rock. Alright. Um, yeah, let's assess this guy. Resistant to physical attacks, damaging its head will pressure it, making physical attacks more effective, and it is weak to lightning, which we just got and I didn't equip. But I do have electric impulse off of my folios, so we can shoot that. Oh! Crap, I uh, probably should have dodged that off. Oh, I do have the thunder spell. Huh! Alright, we got him staggered now. Dang, this thing has a phenomenal amount of HP. Not enough. 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 Not enough.
Let's see, who can we summon? Ifrit or Titan. Let's summon Titan. I don't think he's really going to help us out too much because he's like a big physical attacker, but still more damage is more damage, right? Segments now. Let's use Overfang. Staircase. Thank you kindly. Nice. All right. So I think we might just be done down here. I'll lead to the same place. Oh, okay, that's where actually Aerith flipped the switch then to let us in. Okay, that's where we made it to. Okay. Oh, here we go. Up here. Well, then... They just kind of ran off and left us here? There we go. There they are. Is there anything over here first before we go meet up? Maybe. Well, that's where they were. Not wanting anything over there. We'll just go ahead and meet up. Hey! What took you? Stumbled on the killer rock formation and couldn't tear ourselves away. Right? The ground here could give way at any moment. We shouldn't linger. True. But don't forget. Shinra knows we're here now. Maybe more of them outside. That doesn't make any difference to me. I ain't stopping. Not for them or anyone. Not after Midgar. Not after what we saw. We all know what's at stake here. The fate of the world. So 
So if they get in our way, that's on them. Right. Let's get back to tailing the guys in robes. They're our best chance of finding Sephiroth. All right, so we now have everybody back together. More ogres, great. Whoops. I should probably put a cess back on cloud. I got it. All right, let's uh, dude. All right, let's. Oh my god. Wow, that they just wiped the floor with me. Luckily, I got a lot of HP. First strike materia plus whistle wind scarf. You you just <laughs> yeah that that's a thing. Hey, there's uh, actual light at the end of the tunnel. Oh my! Hey, check it out. Just them? Guess so. Thank you for watching this video. If you made it all the way here to the end, please take a quick second, hit that like button. It really pushes the channel out into the algorithm. While you're down there, you might as well go ahead and hit subscribe to be alerted to any future installments in this series. And once again, thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.